hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's vlog is gonna be a fun one i have a few things to do today that are really fun real exciting one i need to make bridesmaids boxes proposals whatever you want to call them for my bridesmaids i am asking three today i've asked my maid of honor which is my mom and i've asked my friend becca already but i'm asking my friend annabelle and my two cousins abby and savannah today so yes i need to make those three boxes annabelle's abby's and savannah's and then i'm getting ready for my friend maddie's wedding today maddie birch gonna be maddie strope um her wedding is this evening we're gonna get ready and go my fiance and i are going and so i'll go through getting ready with you guys and then i need to pack because we're going to this wedding and then we're spending the night at my brother's apartment tonight yeah. lots of fun stuff right now i'm about to make the bridesmaids proposal boxes which are so cute i've made two obviously my mom's was different i'll insert like a little video right here of what my mom's looked like and then becca's which i've already given to her it looks exactly like the rest of them but yeah i'm really excited so we're gonna get into making them right now because i need to get ready pretty soon because i take forever and we need to leave around like two i think because we're about two two and a half three hours away from jacksonville which is where her wedding is and we don't want to hit traffic and be late so yeah let's do it we're gonna make the boxes right now and then get ready okay so this is a bed right here um i'm gonna make them right here so you can watch what i'm doing i got these boxes you guys are getting a full full insight if you want to do this for a gift or ride days proposal yourself so these boxes are from hobby lobby Itoki. so here's that i'm gonna zoom in a little more so the box and then i'm filling it with paper this is also from hobby lobby just like filler i'm putting in there a little scrunchie it's just like a pink scrunchie um a little tiny perfume um these are just i got from like tj maxx these are from francesca's and then i got them this cute little cup from francesca's let me open it that says brides babes so cute brides babe and then i am throwing in a little what is this rosé prosecco rosé it's really cute it's really just aesthetic throw in i made these little cards for with their name on it asking them to be my bridesmaid with the date and it's just really cute so yeah pop this on here it's how i did the last one and then the perfume What it is looking like? Cute, okay. Once I finally get the freaking bow on, that's what it looks like. And then I got these little bouquets from a local little flower boutique. It's called the Pat Nine Floor. I think she's online too. Like you can order distance and. I got these adorable little bouquets, little dried bouquets, and I just stick them right in between the bow, right there, and that's what it looks like, all finished up, so cute, I'm gonna plop a little, like, note on here to know which one's whose, okay, so yeah, that's how I do them, now I'm just gonna go through, and y'all can watch me through, like, sped, sped up, so, yeah! <laughs> So the boxes are all done they look so cute i cannot wait to give them to the girls but i'm just so excited they look so freaking cute they're exactly what i envisioned them looking like so i love that it is now 11 44 so i'm gonna start getting ready i'm gonna do the wash my face because i put a little makeup on this morning because we went to target and stuff and i just i was really puffy so i put a little makeup on just really mascara and like blush but i'm gonna wash my face start my makeup start my hair get ready for the day because i take a while so yeah let's do it let's get ready 
Okay, so I'm about ready. I'm just waiting on my curls to sit for a little bit and then I'm gonna comb them out. But I have my dress on. Bradley's getting ready now. But I'm about to pack our little weekend bag. I threw some clothes in the little bag down there. Just like bathing suits, pajamas, underwear, quick outfit. None of that. None of that's fun. Um, but I'm about to pack my camera bag with all of my my laptop, chargers. I'll put my camera in there, camera chargers, all that fun stuff. Backpack I have. It's a brevity backpack. Um, it's the camera backpack. It has this awesome organization for camera. So if you're a photographer or if you're in social media or if you just have a camera and you carry it around a lot, I'd really recommend this camera backpack. It's super sleek and no one notices it's a camera backpack so you don't have to worry about carrying around thousands of dollars of gear in your bag. And it's really cute. It's very aesthetic, very matches the vibes. Um, if you want to go somewhere to edit into a coffee shop with this backpack, cute. Um, it's just really nice. There's so many pockets on it. There's this for the organization. There's another little pocket for like quick stuff in here. I have um, hair clips. Random. I've been using this a lot. Um, through the move. Help so much keeping my electronics and all of that really safe and sound and good. Um, but I took it on a trip when I went. When I got engaged um, in Georgia, I brought it and it kept me all organized and kept all my stuff really safe. They have side pockets for like a water bottle. They have a really quick side pouch right here for like your phone, money, whatever you want. And then they also have a little strap to carry it on luggage if you are traveling airlines. So it's really convenient. If you are looking for a good, whoa, um, camera backpack or backpack in general, I would definitely check out the Brevity Backpacks. You can get 10% off of your first order with my code Olivia. Just go to www brevity.co slash olivia for 10% off or just use code olivia at checkout for 10% off of your first order i love this backpack i'm about to pack it up it's so good for all this gear if you don't like the bolder tan color they have so many from blues to pinks all the colors you can think of they have 10 different ones so you can get whatever you like but i really like this neutral bolder tan it's really cute um but it's really comfortable sleek stylish and so useful it's not just cute it has all the pockets doesn't look like your bulky black normal camera bag it's cute discreet sleek comfortable and has a lot of usefulness a lot of uses yeah a lot of uses if you're looking for a cool backpack for camera or just regular backpacks to www.brevity.co slash olivia for 10 percent off of your order i look so ridiculous right now but i'm trying to get some extra volume through my roots so this is the situation i got going on i'm gonna wash my face and do my makeup but i'm gonna do my base makeup off of camera because i feel like that's boring so, yeah. I'll come back with my, like, foundation and all that's done. And then I'll do my eyes and eyebrows and eyelashes and lips and that fun stuff. So, yeah. But this is my current situation. I look silly. Looks like I have a mullet mohawk. Okay. Yeah. I'll see you guys when I'm ready to do my eyes and such. Okay. This is disgusting lighting okay um eyebrows face all done now i'm gonna get into my eyes and i thought i would just talk to you guys a little bit update you on life so life is good life is great but if you notice in the past two videos i have this one and the one before this one i think um you might notice that i have been not at the apartment but at my parents house and that is because we moved from the apartment we moved out of the apartment back into my parents house and i'm gonna tell you guys why let me just start on my eyeshadow so i don't just sit here and talk i was saying we moved out of our apartment and moved back into my parents house because the past two weeks of my life have been crazy um so my dad about two weeks ago now um just about two weeks ago he got sick and went to the hospital and then he got um he had to have emergency surgery, so this is pretty serious, very serious actually, but I'm not going to get super into it, but he had to have emergency surgery, and he was in the hospital for about a week, and then he got to go home um, last Sunday, which was great, thank God, um, very grateful for him to be back home and just with us and um, all that, very grateful for that. Um, but he can't do like anything really 
straining anything. He has a very big incision scar um, on his stomach that is still like, it's not like healed all the way yet, obviously. He can't do anything. Um, he's pretty, pretty much just has to chill, hang out. He can't do that yard work. He can't really, he can't go to work yet. Um, he probably be, bleh, probably will be out of work for another week or so, and then he'll go back, but do like just talk to people, not really do anything. Heavy lifting is a no. He just really can't do stuff around the house. So my parents asked us to move back in with us if we would, me and my Bradley, <laughs> me and Bradley, um, if we would move back in with them to help around the house. Bradley can help do yard work. I got help at the bakery, all those things, instead of just going back and forth because we were gonna help either way. But um, we would have been driving back and forth like 35 miles every day, probably more than once a day. So they asked us to move back and we decided we would. So that's exactly what we did So this past week. Um, following like week of him being in the hospital this whole week we broke our lease and we had to be out by Friday which was yesterday so yeah we had two we pretty much moved out in two days Thursday and Friday we moved out it was so hectic um, very stressful very hard but it's over now and thank goodness because it was just a lot but yes if you're wondering why there's no apartment that's because we don't live there anymore and um yeah i didn't make a vlog because there was it was literally so sudden we weren't prepared at all to move out so there is no vlog of that but i have a few clips i'll insert of me like in the empty apartment but we did move out a little life update that's a big life update actually so yeah um but other than that wedding vibes are on 10 10 out of 10 so fun um, you know, that's still going down. I'm just very grateful my dad is home and healthy, healthier than before, healing here with us, and that we have the relationship to be able to move back into my parents and help because I know some people just couldn't do that. So I'm very grateful for that. But I thought I would update you guys because y'all be seeing a lot in my life. So I was like, well, let me just fill you on in. So yeah, long story short, my dad got sick, had emergency surgery, can't do much at home. He came home, can't do much. They asked us to move in with them and that's exactly what we did. Moved out in two days and here we are. We're great. We're happy that he's here and we're glad to help. So yeah, that's the update on that, but let's do the today game plan. So like I said, we're going to Maddie Birch's wedding. Um, so exciting. Congrats Maddie if you ever see this. Congrats, girlfriend! I'm so excited to see you walk down the aisle and see your dress and see the whole vibe and everything. It's gonna be so pretty. I'm just so excited. And I'm seeing my friend Annabelle. She's going to the wedding. And then a few other social media gals I haven't met before that I will. And it's gonna be super fun. And I'm really excited. I'm asking Annabelle to be a bridesmaid today. So excited for that. Um, I made those little boxes earlier. Um, I don't think I have any more updates right now, but... If I do, I'll let you guys know. But if you're wondering what I'm doing with my makeup, I'm just doing like a purpley vibe. Um, yeah, that's basically that. Some glitter action in here. Okay, this brush sucks. I have something to say, I already thought of something. Videos will be back to normal content of like days of my life and all of that. Just the past two weeks have been insane. Well, the past like honestly month has been crazy. Um, it's almost been a month, not quite, but like three or f three weeks, like three weeks ago ish, got engaged. Like almost two weeks ish, my dad got sick. <sighs> this past week, we moved out of our apartment. It's been crazy, our lives have been crazy, but normal content will be coming back, so all is well. Just thought I'd update you guys so you're not like, what's up with the like different content? Why are you in your parents' house? <laughs> Do, 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 do. Um, you can't see. I have my dress on. I'll show you guys a better view. Also, don't mind the mess. You guys know we're moving, so. Yeah. But I'll show you guys when we're all done with getting ready and about to leave. <laughs> Come in here. <laughs> you look better than me. Whoa, I'm gonna fall forward.
Okay, we are about to leave. We are all dressed. Um, I'll show you a quick outfit. Or I might just insert a picture of us because we don't have time. We have to leave. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, make sure to like it and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!